Hi children, welcome back. I hope you all are enjoying the, these videos. Okay, so in this video, we are going to learn a new topic about the plant. I hope you all have studied already about the plants. But in this uh, uh, video, we are going to study about the plant, how uh, the plant looks and what are the parts of the plants and what are the uses of each part. Okay, then this is what the plant, exactly how the plant looks. This is how the plant is going to look. Here, if you see this straight structure, this is this is called as a stem. Already we have learned this one. And this expanded part is known as leaf. We know that the leaf again leaf, this is also green in color and this will be a broad or broad one or expanded one. Okay. And if you go upside, here you have a yellow color flower. This is called as a, another part of the plant that is flower. And then uh, if you come here, see here, this is what the fruit of this particular plant. Of course, the fruit of uh, other plants or different different plants will be different colors, different taste and they will be used for the different purposes. And here inside the fruit, if you open like this, here we will get the seeds. The seed color may be uh, black or a, that, that may be a green or that may be white. Okay, uh, The seeds are going to have the different different color depending upon its plant, original plant. And here this part is stem from here to here. Okay, And here of course for this plant I don't have the roots but here we will be having the roots. These roots are going to spread inside the ground. Okay, but the roots will be under the ground. They are not going to be above the ground. But the stem part starts from above the ground. Okay, this is what the parts of the plant already uh, you have learnt in your previous classes and you have seen uh, uh, plants, many types of plants in the day to day life. Okay, but uh, once we know the parts of the plants, we must know that what are the uses of the parts of the plant. We know that the plant is going to uh, play a most important role in our life. Without plant, uh, no human being or no other animals are going to uh, live the life or they are not at all going to survive. Okay. So here, each part we, we will see a leaf. Of course, this particular plant may not be used for uh, uh, in a food preparing food for the uh, uh, human beings. But these leaves are going to be used by other animals, which are going to eat these leaves directly without cooking. This is what the food for those animals. But if I if I, if we see the human being, there are so many variety of leaves or uh, types of plants leaves which we can use them as a food okay uh, for them we call as a leafy vegetables then the uh, plant the leaf part of the plant is used as vegetable give me some examples for that the spinach we use coriander leaves we use methi we use and the curry leaves we use and the um, cabbage we uh, use in the uh, cooking or preparing the food those all are the leaf part of the plant then some plants are there which give their leaf part of the plant as a food after the leaf we have a stem here um, potato and the ginger and the turmeric these all are the examples where we are using the stem part of the plant potato is nothing but the modified stem part of the plant then other than a leaf over and the stem over after we have the flower we you, you all will, uh, eat the gobi no that is cauliflower and the broccoli these all are the leaf part of the plant we use them as a cooking or food or a vegetable Okay. Then even the leaf part of the plant is also useful and the uh, sorry a flower part of the plant is also useful and the leaf part of the plant is also useful and the stem part of the plant is also useful. Then after this we have some fruits. For example we all will eat roti, chapati like a muddi 
you all will weak now then uh, how we are going to get this one again we are going to get the jowar wheat and the bajra maize these all we are going to get again from the plant itself then in the plant where they will be present they will be present as a seed like this okay inside the fruit just like a seed they will be present and again we are removing them from the uh, this fruit and we are going to make a flower of that one we will grind that one and that grinded flower is used to prepare a chapati or roti then if there is no roti chapati we will be not able to live alive it is not possible to be alive if we do not eat even the rice also those all are coming from the fruit part of the plant this is how the each part of the plant is used by uh, the human beings and even the other animals also to survive themselves now the stem over leaf over flower over and the seed over even we will eat many types of the fruits there are variety of fruits and they are uh, different in colors and even they give us the different type of energy for example sapota we will eat and the apple we will eat and the custard apple we will eat pineapple we will eat and the mango we are going to eat these all are different types of the uh, fruits we we will get those all the fruits from the different plants even they have the different taste also mango taste will be very different and chikku taste will be very different and the pineapple taste will be very different and the orange taste will be very much different even they are different in the color also and even they are different in the taste also and whatever the energy or whatever the vitamins they give for our body are also very much different so this is how the each part of the plant is going to be helpful for a human being and even the other animals also other animals like cow buffalo donkey monkey and birds and the um, horses these all types of uh, animals most they eat even the part of the plant itself they are also dependent on the plants itself they will eat any any part of the plants that may be leaf that may be fruit that may be flower they will eat different part of the plants and they are going to live their life okay i hope you have got the clear picture about the parts of the plant and even the uses of the plants parts of different parts of the plants okay children before going to uh, end this video i am going to give you a homework you should uh, write any five uh, parts of the plant and their uses okay i hope you will do this homework once again i'll repeat any five parts of the plants and their uses only one one sentence you should take a help of your parents and you have to write those helps or those uh, uses okay i hope you will do this homework in the next video we will discuss about the next one